Imagine a world where connectivity knows no bounds. A world where even the most remote wilderness is just as connected as the busiest city center. Seamless, high-speed internet access anywhere on Earth is no longer just a futuristic dream. It's rapidly becoming reality as Huawei sets into motion its ambitious plan to launch 10,000 satellites, building a next-generation 6G network from space. This bold endeavor isn't just about advancing technology. It's a direct challenge to existing giants like Starlink, the satellite internet service led by Elon Musk's SpaceX. With this move, Huawei is pushing the boundaries of what's possible in global telecommunications and signaling a massive shift in the industry. Unlike traditional networks that rely heavily on physical infrastructure like cell towers and fiber optic cables, Huawei's approach focuses on a space-based system that brings coverage to places once thought unreachable. These 10,000 satellites will form a dense constellation orbiting the planet, creating a blanket of connectivity with ultra-low latency, crucial for emerging technologies such as autonomous vehicles, real-time holographic communication, and complex Internet of Things IoT, ecosystems. As this system comes online, it could fundamentally shift the balance of power in satellite internet. Starlink, which currently has around 4,000 satellites in low Earth orbit and has played a pivotal role in expanding internet access to underserved regions, may soon face serious competition. Huawei's system is not just larger in scale, but also more advanced in terms of speed, reliability, and adaptability, potentially rendering current solutions outdated. But the implications of Huawei's satellite network extend well beyond tech specs. In an era where digital infrastructure is deeply tied to national security and economic competitiveness, this project positions China at the forefront of a new digital frontier. The ripple effects could touch geopolitics, trade, and the global tech landscape as countries reassess their digital alliances and dependencies. This isn't just about better internet. It's about global influence and control over the future of communication. Central to Huawei's vision is an array of cutting-edge technologies designed to enable seamless connectivity on a global scale. The satellite constellation will be split between roughly 8,000 satellites in low Earth orbit, situated between 500 and 2,000 kilometers above the Earth, and about 2,000 satellites in geostationary orbit, stationed approximately 35 to 800 kilometers above the equator. This dual orbit strategy balances high speed, low latency service with stable, broad regional coverage, ensuring performance that adapts to different geographic needs. Huawei's satellites are built with advanced electric propulsion systems enabling precise orbital control while using significantly less fuel, which in turn extends their operational life. Enhanced solar panel designs and improved energy storage systems allow these satellites to operate reliably even during prolonged periods of darkness, a common challenge in space. On the communication front, these satellites employ state-of-the-art technologies, including terahertz frequency bands capable of supporting data transfer speeds far beyond what 5G can offer as well as sophisticated beamforming capabilities that focus signals precisely where needed. This ensures stronger, more efficient connections while minimizing interference. The network is also equipped with AI-powered management systems that monitor traffic, allocate resources dynamically, and adapt in real time to changing user demands. This kind of intelligent automation will be crucial as billions of devices begin to rely on ultra-fast, always-on connectivity. And when it comes to security, Huawei isn't cutting corners. Their satellites incorporate robust encryption protocols and quantum-resistant algorithms to defend against cyber attacks and ensure the safe transmission of sensitive data. As more aspects of society, healthcare, transportation, education, commerce, go digital, the need for secure and resilient networks has never been greater. By combining scale, innovation, and strategic intent, Huawei's satellite network is not just setting the stage for 6G, it's rewriting the playbook for global connectivity. This initiative could redefine how nations communicate, how businesses operate, and how individuals across the world access information and services. The future is arriving faster than anyone expected, and it's coming from above. Huawei is not just entering the satellite internet market, it's aiming to transform it entirely. Rather than simply competing with existing services like Starlink, Huawei seeks to redefine what global connectivity can mean in the era of 6G. Its approach combines meticulous engineering, groundbreaking technology, and strategic foresight to create a seamless and intelligent network infrastructure. Every element in its planned constellation of 10,000 satellites is designed to interoperate as part of a broader vision, a global, resilient, adaptive system that could revolutionize industries, elevate communities, and bridge long-standing digital divides. As this next-generation satellite infrastructure begins to take shape, 
the competition between Huawei and SpaceX's Starlink becomes a focal point in the race for satellite internet dominance. While both companies aim to provide global coverage and fast, reliable internet, their methods diverge significantly. Starlink, the current market leader, has already launched over 4,000 satellites and continues to scale its service rapidly. Its early entry and ongoing expansion give it a significant presence, especially in rural and underserved regions where terrestrial broadband remains scarce or non-existent. Huawei, however, is building a network from the ground up that is not just larger, but fundamentally different. Its planned constellation, optimized specifically for 6G capabilities, is designed to deliver faster speeds, lower latency, and more efficient spectrum usage than anything currently available. Utilizing cutting-edge technologies like beamforming and terahertz frequency bands, Huawei's system could potentially support data transmission rates in the range of multiple terabits per second. That's not just an improvement, it's a reimagining of what satellite internet can achieve. Central to this transformation is Huawei's use of AI-driven network management. Unlike traditional networks that operate on fixed parameters, Huawei's intelligent system will dynamically adjust based on user demand, traffic patterns, and environmental conditions. This means more stable connections, smarter load balancing, and a network that essentially thinks on its feet. Such adaptability is crucial in a world where the demand for data is growing exponentially. Driven by everything from streaming and gaming to real-time industrial applications and autonomous systems. While Starlink continues to evolve its platform and improve user experience, it may struggle to keep pace with the speed and scale of innovation Huawei is bringing to the table. The latter's massive investment in research and development, coupled with deep partnerships across global telecom ecosystems, positions it to leapfrog traditional limitations in satellite internet performance. Cost is another critical dimension of this race. SpaceX has made remarkable strides in reducing costs through reusable rocket technology and mass production. These efficiencies have allowed Starlink to bring satellite internet to a wider user base at increasingly competitive prices. However, Huawei is employing a different cost reduction strategy. Its satellites will use electric propulsion systems, which are lighter and more fuel efficient, and advanced solar panels that extend operational lifespan. These innovations could significantly lower the cost per satellite and make it viable for Huawei to offer attractive pricing models, particularly in developing markets where affordability is key. Moreover, Huawei's extensive global presence and political alliances, especially within China and among emerging economies, could unlock government-backed subsidies and public-private partnerships that further lower end-user costs. Local telecom providers might integrate Huawei's satellite service into broader national connectivity plans, accelerating adoption in areas that have long lagged behind in internet infrastructure. From a branding and market standpoint, Starlink holds undeniable advantages. Its association with Elon Musk and SpaceX gives it a high-profile image that attracts early adopters and tech enthusiasts. It benefits from a growing, loyal user base and the publicity that comes with every rocket launch and network milestone. Yet, Huawei counters with decades of experience in global telecommunications, a deep bench of technical talent, and a strategic focus on regions where digital infrastructure is underdeveloped but demand is rising. In these areas, Huawei's entry into satellite internet is not just welcome, it's seen as essential. This battle between Starlink and Huawei is more than a technological rivalry. It's shaping up to be a defining chapter in the geopolitics of digital infrastructure. As more countries seek digital sovereignty and look to escape dependence on Western technology providers, Huawei's offer of an independent, advanced alternative becomes even more appealing. Nations may view Huawei's 6G satellite network as a strategic asset, one that brings secure communications, economic development, and international leverage. The implications of Huawei's satellite projects stretch far beyond speed tests and subscriber numbers. If successful, it will unlock transformative change across countless sectors. Consider education. Students in remote villages could join virtual classrooms alongside peers from major cities, accessing resources and instruction that were previously out of reach. In healthcare, doctors could perform remote diagnostics or even robotic surgeries with real-time precision, regardless of location. Entire business ecosystems could emerge in areas that were once digitally isolated, driven by access to cloud computing, digital marketplaces, and mobile banking. In agriculture, real-time data from IoT sensors connected via satellite could revolutionize crop management, water usage, and yield prediction. Logistics companies could optimize routes and delivery chains across continents with pinpoint accuracy. In transportation, autonomous vehicles and drones would benefit from ultra-low latency connections enhancing safety, coordination, and efficiency. The 6G satellite network could serve as the digital nervous system for smart cities, enabling intelligent traffic systems, 
energy grids, and public safety networks. However, with these vast possibilities come significant challenges. The sheer scale of connectivity opens new frontiers for cyber threats. A network that touches every corner of the globe must be resilient against hacking, surveillance, and data breaches, ensuring the security and privacy of users while enabling seamless, borderless communication will require unprecedented levels of cooperation between governments, corporations, and regulatory bodies. Moreover, as we move toward constant global connectivity, there are cultural and ethical considerations. The spread of digital infrastructure can blur local identities, create dependencies on foreign technology, and exacerbate surveillance concerns. Just as the internet has connected people, it has also sparked debates over digital rights, censorship, and control. Huawei's network could intensify these tensions, particularly if it becomes enmeshed in broader geopolitical rivalries. And yet the potential for positive transformation is immense. Huawei's network, if implemented ethically and securely, could help create a more inclusive, connected, and innovative world. It could empower communities to leapfrog generations of technological development and participate in the global digital economy on equal footing. By enabling access to tools, knowledge, and services, it would offer a chance to level the playing field in an increasingly digital world. As we stand on the brink of this shift, one thing is clear. The future of global connectivity will not be defined by a single company or country, but by how we choose to navigate the opportunities and responsibilities that come with it. Huawei's 6G satellite network is more than a technological marvel. It's a symbol of the new frontier in digital transformation. Whether it becomes the dominant model or part of a broader ecosystem, its impact will be felt across industries, borders, and generations. So what excites you most about the future of 6G? Is it the prospect of seamless global access, the potential for smart cities, or the empowerment of remote communities? Let us know your thoughts. And if you found this deep dive into the evolving satellite internet landscape valuable, be sure to like, share, and comment with your ideas for future topics. Should we explore the rise of quantum computing, the geopolitical battle for semiconductor supremacy, or how artificial intelligence is reshaping labor markets? Subscribe to Revo and join a community of innovators, thinkers, and changemakers as we explore the technologies shaping tomorrow. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.